Hi. Hi. We are the Chain Brothers, and I'm Andre. And I'm Garrison. Today we have two special guests with us. He is Panda. And this is Tricycle. <laughs> He's a Triceratops. He's not a rhino. All right. Okay. So today our topic is gonna be animals in Chinese. So let's start. Okay, the first animal is a rabbit or conejo. In Chinese, that is tu, tu, and sometimes we add an extra z at the end. It's just a friendlier way of calling those rabbits. Hi. He's a rabbit. Yeah. Okay, the next one is vaca or cow, and in Chinese, that is niu. Nyo. Like, here's a cow. Mm. Alright. The next one is pescado or fish. In Chinese, that is. He's a clownfish. In Chinese, there's a lot of different fish fish names. So, so you don't have to remember this. This but a clownfish is called Xiao Chou Yu. Uh, just saying it for fun. All right, and then it's pajaro or bird, and in Chinese that is miao miao. Hi. Like him. He's a bird. He's also an owl. In Chinese, that is a mao to ying. But you don't have to remember that. It's just for fun. All right, and the next one is bato or duck. That in Chinese is ya zi, ya zi. And you can say the zi if you want to, but you, it's not necessary. All right, he's a duck. Yeah, he's upside down. Ugh. Okay, here is he. Here he is. All right. Now the next one is perro or dog, which is also the last one. Hi, I'm a dog. He's a yeah. He's also a dog, and in Chinese it's go, go, <laughs> squeak, squeak. All right. Now I finishing uh I finished sharing my my things. All right, now we're going to let uh, my brother Garrison review the words. Okay. Okay. So, um so over here, uh there's again these Chinese characters if you're interested in them. And over here are these to help you pronounce it, but it's not really accurate. So if you want to be really accurate, you can just um, list, you can just listen to this again or watch this again. And we'll also have worksheets, and the worksheets will be in the description of the video in the first comment of the video. Okay, so I'm gonna start. So the first one is yo yo. Which it also means vaca or cow. Like he's a cow. And this one is tu. Tu. And you can also call it tu zi. Tu zi. Which is a friendlier way. <laughs> and it also means conejo or rabbit. And this one is. Yu, which it means pescado or fish, and this one is pajaro or bird, which is yao, yao, and this one is yazi, yazi, or you can just say it as ya. Yeah, and it also means bato or duck. And this one is go, go, and it also means perro or duck. <laughs>
All right, now we finishing um uh sharing and reviewing our um our words. Now now we're gonna take out real stuffed animals and then we can say them in Chinese. All right, All right. let's let's start with him. <laughs> he he's a duck, and in Chinese that is ya ya, and you can say ya zi if you want. Battle oh, pig. All right, and the the next one is a cow, or vaca, and in Chinese that is niu, niu. Like me in the Chinese <laughs> zodiac, I'm um I'm a cow. <laughs> All right, and then the other one is dog or perro, and in Chinese that is go, go. All right. Okay, so uh, he's a rabbit or a conejo, and in Chinese, that is tu zi, tu zi, hai, and, and you can also call it as tu, tu, yeah, <laughs> okay, and this one is a fish or a pescado, wow. And in Chinese, that's <laughs> And this one is a pájaro or a bird, with, and it's and in Chinese that is Niao Niao All right. Now we finish sharing our our um animals in Chinese. So again, there's worksheets in the first comment below or in the description, so you can get the worksheet if you want it. All right. So if you like our videos, you can hit the subscribe and the bell button. Please subscribe and hit the bell button. Bye bye.